After the storms, the extreme heat is on, and it's going to be a long haul. Doctors say don't underestimate the toll heat can have on your health. CBS 2's Vanessa Murdoch live in West New York, New Jersey, with some tips on how to stay cool. Vanessa. Yeah, heat happens to be the leading cause of weather-related deaths in the U.S. And while we're not forecasting all-time record heat like they're experiencing in Europe right now, we certainly have to take this extended heat wave seriously. Blaring sun, temperatures, and humidity rising. A heat advisory goes into effect tomorrow. Colin Frank admits sweats already rolling. I actually had heat exhaustion a couple of times, so I stay hydrated. I always carry water around. Heat exhaustion, the most common heat related illness, is Dr. Betsy Varghese of Hackensack University Medical Center. Patients will complain of um, fatigue, they may have headache, dizziness. Don't underestimate the impact of heat when it comes to your health. Stick with the basics. A hat, sunglasses, sunscreen, or good old-fashioned shade. Get ahead of the hydration. Start drinking water early in the day and right before heading out. Always have a bottle of water with you. Exactly how avid cyclist Chris Sharadsky rolls. Try to stop every 20 minutes or so to take a drink. Enjoy the weather and go back to the air conditioning. <laughs> Julian Waugh hails originally from England. They're going through a lot of heat there and they don't have air conditioning in England at all. And what's been happening over there defies reason. A new all-time record high for the UK set today at 104.5 degrees. Richard Seeger, research professor of Lamont Doherty Earth Observatory, shares the human toll of the extreme heat across Europe. In Portugal and Spain, um, actually hundreds of people have died as a result of this um, from heat exposure and then some from a range of fires that are burning. Seeger describes the heat stress as tremendous, says we can learn from it. Anticipate the unexpected. Don't fight the necessities and you'll be able to enjoy the heat. Um, much more comfortably. Precisely what Trayvon Carroll plans to do. I actually enjoy the heat. You know, I got the melanin for it. He'll be heading down shore to Sandy Hook or the water park at American Dream just to keep cool. All right, the name of the game is to keep cool. Coming up at six, we speak to the FDNY on more tips of how to stay cool and how they keep their firefighters safe in the heat. We also speak to a veterinarian who says they have specific things to look for in your pet for heat stroke. We'll share those with you as well. We're live right now from West New York. Vanessa Murdoch, CBS 2 News. All important information, Vanessa. Thank you.